And we back with another one. FYBJ Main, I'm telling you right now. Hey, THF and O Block, they ain't feeling the whoops, bro. Yeah, they don't, they don't like how you whooping, bro. And being from Chicago, you already know. Once you start over whooping, it's a good chance you can get whopped. Now, J Man, I see you pushing the piece. I see you got the whoops on corporate. I see you doing uh comedy skits with the whoops and all that, and you doing your thing, and that's cool. You cannot force people to be involved with this that don't want to be involved with this because that's how you gonna end up getting backdoor, or that's how you gonna end up getting shot and killed. You know what I'm saying? So we about to get in all that, man. The old blockings and THF and them, they, they not feeling the whoops. They not rocking with the whoops, bro. So you need to leave them alone with all that. Now, going to King Von Miro and putting these whoops down there, you know what I'm saying? Without, you should have you said something peaceful. You should have, you know what I'm saying? You should have did it different. And they took it as disrespect. So because they took it as disrespect, now, you got a whole lot of stuff coming your way. But we about to get into all that. So, we going to go on here and start where it started at. King Von need these hoops. I'm leaving these right here for the old blackies. Let's start there. I ain't gonna lie, Jay, man, you right. Let's start there. You know you ain't got no business being right there. <laughs> and it ain't got nothing to do with the fact that you from Chicago. You one of the dudes that was from Chicago that you left from the other side, so-called because you got off a bus one day and the BDs jumped you or whatever, whatever you went to Duckham side for. And then you went to Duckham side, and then when you got over there, you start dissing them a whole lot. Your cousin, Lil Reese, Von, and with all of them. You was, diss, you was dissing everybody over there. At the Von Dad, you still kept dissing Von. You got a video where you dressed up like Von and put dreads in your head. Certain people ain't going to forget that stuff. They not telling you you can't push peace. They not telling you they, you know what I'm saying, got a problem with you whooping. They just don't want you whooping with them, and they not playing with you like that. So, being from Chicago, and you doing this, and if something happens to you, I don't want people to be shocked. Because another thing I noticed is, is that if you running around with a shiesty on, but you in Chicago and people still know it's you, that shiesty serves no purpose. That shiesty don't mean nothing. You ain't even paid attention in or even seen the people that said they seen you and knew exactly where you was at. Back door central. Anybody could have came up and smoked you. That's neither here nor there. Let's go on to the next thing. So now, when he did that, so Duke spoke out, and Duke said, I got a question. I need answers. At uh, FYBJ May, if you pushing peace, why you got a hood and a shiesty on? First time I ever seen this in one of your videos. Second, who approved or told you it was good for you to do that? From my point of view, you trying to be funny. He look at it as you trying to be funny. At the end of the day, you have to know what to do and what not to do. You took your comedian to another level, something you know that's unacceptable. <laughs> hey. You know what gang members get to use the big words? They mad. So, yeah, j Man, uh, yeah, they say your action with the whoops is unacceptable. Period. Point blank. They not in agreeing with this. Now, of course, this got back to j Man, and j Man had more to say. Let's start there. You can't tell me that I can't go to King Von Miro, bro. Let's start there. You ain't even pay for it, dude. Let's start there. You didn't put on. I think Kima put on. You didn't put on for Von Mural, bro. You can't. Then you tell me Jay Man got a shicey mask on, bro. It ain't different. When I'm in Chicago, I do wear my PGF nook, bro. Do your homework on me being a celebrity, bro. Do I gotta go there? Do I gotta go there? What slick at? Why? 
Why is other old blockians whooping like that? Where's T Slick with the one eye? Let's start up. I was just with Slick. Why is all y'all requesting me? I'm trying to talk to Slick, bro. Slick, send a request. Get your people. I'm out here pushing peace now. Y'all over whooping. Y'all over whooping. I'm bringing the city together. Y'all over whooping. Hold on, I can't find it. I'm from Chicago. Now, this the thing about that. Yeah, you did the skits with T Slick. Y'all had some conversations and y'all did some skits. T Slick can't speak for everybody. You know that. Anybody from Chicago know that. Y'all remember when King Yellow was out here and when King Yellow was trying to push peace? Yeah, they tried to push his ass up out of here. When you <laughs> when you understand that, bro, how you feel and what you want to do is cool. It's going to be certain people that agree with you. It's going to be certain people that's not going to agree with you. But you need to stay as far away from as you can the people that don't agree with you because here you will lose your life for that. Here you will be killed for that. It ain't no, it ain't no, y'all, you, you playing. I got, I got whoops there. Well, uh, somebody come get a box of whoops. That'll be your last whoop. I ain't risking my life over no whoops, bro. And you say the whoops only a hundred dollars. So if your life only worth a hundred dollars, keep moving your whoops to here. That's all I'm gonna tell you, bro. But, but I'm trying to tell you right now, bro. Your location has been exposed. Your low has been exposed. When you was around, how you was around, it's been exposed. And I ain't seeing y'all running around without no heat. But at the same time, you know, just like I know, here you would die with your gun on you. Just because you got it don't mean nothing. All I'm saying is, why are you making yourself a target with these whoops? Let's start there. You shouldn't be making yourself a target with the whoops. If somebody want to push peace, cool, they want to push peace. You shouldn't have never went to King Von Mirror, bro, but that's your weight. You got to carry it. What Shark say? Take your weight. You got to take your weight. Now, Shoebox Baby said, you... You made a million songs dissing people who died from old block to gain clout. Don't try to act sincere towards the same people you made fun of down there to gain clout. That neighborhood ain't no free enterprise. I respect your hustle, but go hustle somewhere. You actually welcome that. Life and death ain't no joke, and I feel like you think it is. See, they think now that they feel like you over whooping because they feel like you playing with your life right now. So now you overdoing the whoops. It's crazy, man. It's putting their whole life on the line for whoops. So then, Zoo them got wind of it. And then they said, oh, he want to choke. Man, they done threw the whoops all on the floor. Then stepped all on the whoops. They Zoo say niggas want to play and troll. We know we going to play and troll. On car, we get on this internet. On car, you know how Zoo get. Oh, we playing on this internet? I'm going to play on this internet. Zoo the last person you want playing on the internet. Because you know he ain't going to stop and he don't care. But you still trying to push these whoops though. All right, cool. Well... Zoo them to tell you how they feel about your whoop. So we're going to go ahead and start there. Hey, man, they say the whoop tastes like Play Doh. Why y'all do the whoops like that? No, I don't have them. They whooping, y'all. Man, why y'all doing the whoops like that? Man, they say the whoops tastes like Play Doh. Why y'all do the whoops like that? No, I don't have them. They whooping, y'all. Jay Man, they said the whoops taste like Play Doh. <laughs> Let's start there, bro. THF don't like how the whoops taste. O Block ain't never taste them. They ain't gonna never taste them. They don't care about the whoops at all. Jay Man, you know this city better than anybody. I'm telling you, bro. They ain't playing. <laughs> like, I don't know if you know it or not, but they they not playing, bro. Yeah, they don't they they ain't trying to hear nothing about you or your whoops, bro. All I'm saying is the whoops ain't worth your life, bro. If but if you feel like the whoops worth your life, keep doing that. And the people that's finna get on here, well, why they why they bother him if he's trying to push pitch? I gotta understand something. He did a whole lot of stuff before that that wasn't peaceful. 
He ain't do no diss song about your uh your brother, your cousin, your uncle, your nephew. So you can't tell other people how to feel about a situation, bro. But like I said, J-Man, keep moving around with them whoops. You get whopped. Hey, it's on you, brother. Everybody else gonna, gonna keep moving on. We're gonna keep going on. With. That's why at the King Yellowhead got shot. When nobody else trying to push the peak. For what? Who finna get pushed up out of here for trying to be cool with somebody? For trying to be cool with people? Just like 600 Breeze, he told Yellow. We ain't never had no real beef. What is that a piece out? Just leave it alone, bruh. If you ain't saying my name and I ain't saying your name, that's as much peace as we need. Ain't no sense to whoop together. Ain't no sense to, but like I said, man, people, people start doing stuff for this internet and then try to exclude this internet from real life. And now you overdoing the whoop. Then you getting mad because you overdid your whoop and now you don't like how they whooping. They may ain't no end up whopped. Y'all get in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think. Boy, boot, I'm out.